Want to see more cool videos on our channel? We do, so press this bell and enable to send notifications. Ships we come across nowadays are large, sturdy and self-propelled vessels, sailing against sea currents to transport cargo and other merchandise across international ports. Though some think the very first seaworthy boats are most probably built around 800,000 years ago, the current ships have undergone countless centuries of development work to become what they are today. Today we're going to tell you about 10 of the biggest and most elegant ships sailing around the globe which are purposely built with no other match in their class. So hang on to your life jackets as we embark on the journey to discover some of the biggest floating structures of the modern day world. Number 10. Q-Max Vessels the Q-Max or the Qatar Max is the largest liquefied natural gas LNG carrier class in the world. The first Q-Max LNG carrier was floated out of dry dock in 2007 and this new breed of liquefied natural gas carriers was immediately acknowledged as an industry breakthrough in size and design. Q-Max carriers are even longer than three football fields combined and stand 20 stories tall from their keel to masthead. These gas tankers are also equipped with the largest membrane containment tanks ever built. The typical Q-Max tanker is 345 meters long, 53.8 meters wide, and can reach up to 34.7 meters in height. With a draft of over 12 meters, the vessel has a cargo capacity of around 266,000 cubic meters. Q-Max are propelled by two slow-speed diesel engines which are environmentally friendly and more thermally efficient consuming 40% less energy with 30% fewer emissions while retaining service speed of up to 19.5 knots. Alongside its extraordinary operational servicing, these vessels are also known for their excellent constructional features, specifically pertaining to the usage of silicon in its lower structure to ensure the protection and safety of the marine ecology. Number 9. CSCL Globe. As the competition picks up every day, the battle to own the largest container ships is bringing significant pace and progress in the construction of even more larger ships. A classic example is the CSCL Globe, which was revealed in 2014 by China Shipping Container Lines, removing Mesk's Triple E vessel from its title of the world's largest container ship in the world. To put the size of this humongous container ship into perspective, one CSCL globe is even longer than four standard football pictures combined. The ship is 400 meters long and 58 meters wide and can weigh up to 184,000 tons when carrying a full cargo load. That's like the equivalent of 14,500 London buses. CSCL globe is not just ridiculously big, but it's also serving its purpose well. It can house 19,000 cargo containers which would stretch 115 kilometers if laid end to end. The ship is powered with a 17 meter tall engine, which is the largest engine ever built for a ship. This impressive ship with a unique engine can reach a service speed of 20.5 knots and is designed to maximize fuel efficiency while reducing noise and carbon dioxide emissions. Like the Triple E, the CSCL Globe was not able to hang on to its title of the largest container ship in the world for very long and lost its title to MSC Oscar. Number 8. Oasis of the Seas Well, we've been talking about the size of tankers, vessels and cargo ships, but have you ever wondered what it would be like to sail and visit exotic destinations on one of the biggest and most elegant cruise ships in the world? The number 8 on our list is Oasis of the Seas that not only features an amazing and innovative at-sea experience, but also a groundbreaking design consisting of 7 distinct neighborhoods and 16 decks. The ship is 208 feet wide and 1,187 feet long, with actual mass of the vehicle estimated at approximately 100,000 metric tons. Oasis of the Seas has a long 30-foot draft and an estimated height of 72 meters above the waterline. This innovative floating land can accommodate up to 6,296 passengers and a huge crew of over 2,000 people to handle onboard activities. The cruise ship is also equipped with 18 lifeboats each with a toilet on board. This miniature city has all of the amenities you can think of while sailing the high seas. Throughout the ship, you'll find cutting-edge technologies like touchscreen signage, video walls, the fastest internet at sea with multiple bars and lounges. Among other attractions are an aqua theater pool, 5.4 meters deep, two rock climbing walls, the obligatory casino and 21 swimming pools and jacuzzis. You can even enjoy an ice skating rink, a sea spa with state-of-the-art fitness center and much more than you can imagine. Don't you think it's time to book your next cruise to see this unmatched beauty? Number 7. 
Pioneering Spirit. The number seven on our list is the Pioneering Spirit, the world's largest vessel by gross tonnage. It's basically a heavy lift construction vessel that's designed to execute single lift installation and decommissioning of large offshore oil and gas platforms, as well as installation of subsea oil and gas pipelines. In 2017, Pioneering Spirit set a world lifting record with the removal of a 24,000 ton Brent Delta platform. Designed by Swiss-based All Seas Group, the 382-metre-long and 124-metre-wide vessel entered service in 2016. This giant sea crane can accommodate up to 571 personnel in two berth cabins. It also features a double-joint factory with five line-up stations and a helicopter deck to support the operations of a single rotorcraft. This vessel is fitted with subsea position reference systems, including a high-precision acoustic positioning system and eight diesel generators which provide thrust for the vehicle to reach its maximum speed of 14 knots. Credited to its mammoth size, the engineering marvel has got a very good wave response behavior which enables the pioneering spirit to make a large lift in hostile sea conditions. It can work accurately in eddy water depths while sailing under her own power which makes it not only suitable for worldwide use but even in polar regions as well. Number 6. Quantum Class Cruise Ship Number 6 on our list is the Royal Caribbean's Quantum Class Ship, which is built on a legacy of innovation and creative design. The Quantum of the Seas was the first of three cruise ships in the Quantum Class, which was honoured as the Cruise Ship of the Year in 2016, as the jury recognised it had set standards in the field. This amazing cruise ship is 348 metres long and 41 metres wide with a gross tonnage capacity of approximately 168,666 tonnes. Quantum of the Seas is equipped with a diesel-electric propulsion system that boosts it with a maximum cruising speed of 22 knots. This elite cruise can accommodate a total of 4,905 guests in its 16-passenger accessible decks, eight of which feature balcony state rooms overlooking the ocean. Other recreational facilities aboard the vessel include a surf simulator measuring 40 feet, a rock climbing wall measuring 40 feet above the deck, a spa, a casino and an outdoor movie screen measuring 220 feet. Quantum of the Seas has a unique skydiving wind tunnel technology in a flight chamber made of glass, which provides a skydiving style experience on board to its worthy guests. Let us know in the comments which class you would choose between Oasis and Quantum for your next cruise. Number 5. USS Nimitz USS Nimitz is one of the biggest aircraft carriers in the world today, which was named after Chester W. Nimitz, a commander of the United States Pacific Fleet in World War II. The warship was officially put into active duty in the year 1975 at a cost of approximately $1 billion US dollars. The Nimitz-class carriers are a kind of floating airport capable of launching as many as four aircraft a minute while reaching a maximum speed of over 30 knots. The ship measures 1,092 feet in length, which is nearly as long as the Empire State Building, and has a commanding tower situated 20 stories above the waterline with a 4.5-acre flight deck. This sea giant has a displacement of over 100,000 tons, thanks to its 47,000 tons of structural steel and about a million pounds of aluminium used in its construction. The Nimitz-class ship can accommodate 3,184 personnel and typically carries 80-plus combat aircraft, four high-speed aircraft elevators, each more than 4,000 square feet that bring planes to the flight deck from the hangar below. The aircraft carrier is supplied by two water reactors rather than the gas turbines or diesel-electric systems placed for propulsion on modern warships. The Nimitz-class carriers have a lifespan of approximately 50 years and being the oldest active aircraft carrier, it's projected to be replaced around 2022. Number 4. MS Burj Stahl Burj Stahl is the world's longest and largest iron ore carrier for a full 25 years, and to date, it's famous amongst all mega bulk carriers ever to sail the ocean currents. This magnificent vessel was built in 1986 as a bulk iron ore carrier, with a capacity of 364,767 tons dead weight. The vessel is about 1,122 feet long, with a width of 63 meters, and her draft goes to 23 meters when she's fully loaded with iron ore. This equals to over 11,150 trucks. To date, this pioneer of the sea has covered enough miles to make almost five trips to the moon. It can carry as much iron ore to produce steel for three Golden Gate bridges. She's hauled a total of 8 million metric tons of iron ore to Europe, 
enough to build 9.5 million cars. The ship is equipped with a diesel engine that drives a single 30-foot propeller and puts out 27,610 horsepower with a top speed of 13.5 knots. Due to its massive size, the ship can only tie up fully loaded at two ports in the world, hauling ore from the Terminal Maritimo de Ponta de Madeira in Brazil to the Europort near Rotterdam in the Netherlands. Number 3. MV Barzan Have you ever seen an ultra-large container ship? If not, then have a look at this huge ship known as MV Barzan, whose most obvious characteristic is its jaw-dropping size. Having a DWT of 199,744 and a gross tonnage of 195,636, MV Barzan was the largest container ship when it was built by Hyundai Heavy Industries in South Korea in 2015 for the United Arab Shipping Company. The ship is 58 meters wide and has a length of about 400 meters. The ship has a 16 meter long draft and a container capacity of 18,800 TEU. MV Barzan can cruise at a speed of 22.8 knots. Another thing that made MV Barzan famous is its instant acclamation as the industry's most eco-efficient container vessel since her energy efficiency design index is quoted as almost 50% less than the International Maritime Organization limit set for 2025. The MV Barzan is equipped with an eco-friendly system incorporating state-of-the-art technologies to meet the reinforced maritime regulations. Number 2. Sea Wise Giant Unlike Titanic, the story of the tanker that was once known as the Sea Wise Giant is much less familiar, although it's every bit as memorable. Nearly 50 feet longer than the Empire State Building, Sea Wise Giant was the largest moving man made object on the planet Earth. This gargantuan sea vessel was actually bombed, completely sunk, and then hauled from the seabed and patched up to serve another 21 years. The aptly named Sea Wise Giant was built in Japan in 1979 for a Greek business mogul. By the time she was ready, the original owner went bankrupt and failed to foot the bills for a shipyard. Later on, the ship was sold to a Chinese shipping company who ordered a refitting of the tanker to make it the largest ship ever to sail. Just how big was the Sea Wise Giant? This 1,000-foot-long, 226-foot-wide ship had a record capacity of 564,763 metric tons dead weight, with a deck space of around 31,541 square meters and 46 tanks. Unfortunately, this Marvel ship became a casualty of the Iran-Iraq War in 1988, and suddenly the world's largest ship was the world's largest shipwreck. The tanker's owners wrote her off as a total loss. After the end of the war, the wreckage was pulled out by a Norwegian company, which extensively repaired the ship and named it Happy Giant, because, hey, who wouldn't be happy to get a second shot at life? In 1991, the ship was resold and the biggest ship in the world received her third name, the Jarrah Viking, for the next 13 years. Finally, the ship was stationed in 2004 after another name change to the Nok Nevis and eventually dismantled in India's Alang Sosia shipbreaking yards in January 2010. Number 1. Symphony of the Seas The second to none on our list is one of the newest ships in Royal Caribbean's Oasis fleet, famously known as Symphony of the Seas. Launched in 2018, it was the largest and most ambitious cruise ship ever built. In numbers, the Symphony of the Seas measures 361 meters in length, which is about five times the size of the Titanic. It's equipped with four 14.4 MW and two 19.2 MW diesel engines, which power the ship and make it 30% more efficient than her oldest sibling. The ship has a gross tonnage of approximately 228,000 and can accommodate 6,680 passengers at maximum capacity, including a trained crew of around 2,200 people. There are 18 decks, nearly four football fields long, out of which 16 are for guest use. Symphony of the Seas has a whopping 2,759 staterooms, 40 restaurants and bars, 23 pools, two West End sized theatres, an ice rink with a 10 story fun slide two climbing walls and a mini golf course as well. To put it another way, Symphony of the Seas might be the most ludicrously entertaining luxury hotel in history. It just also happens to float. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please let me know by clicking the like button, do share, write a comment, and don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch up my next video.